All right, hey, my name is Sam. I'm here with WBRU with Walk the Moon. What's up, guys? Hello. Hey. Hi. <laughs> Last time we saw Walk the Moon, they were pelting dodgeballs on trampolines at small children. Maybe not small children, but definitely children. They were, anyway. like, they were teenagers. At teenagers, least. teenagers. All right. They signed waivers. They signed waivers. It's okay. Correct. That is also correct. All right, so we're going to play 5 and 95. And first question is if your band were a movie, what would it be called and who would play you? Wow. Uh, it would Indiana Nick and the Temple of uh, Back to the Futures. No. Uh, who, who would play you? And uh, obviously Patrick Swayze would play me. This is it's an old movie. <laughs> <laughs> Missy Elliott would start her acting career by playing me. Um, I'd be played by played by uh, 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 Jeff Goldblum. <laughs> John Belushi. Question number two: What is the first concert you ever went to? Mm. Kansas. Carry on my Weird Al. <laughs> uh, Faith Hill and Tim McGraw. Also Weird Al. <laughs> <laughs> I've met so many people whose first concert was Weird Al, surprisingly. Yeah, like two of my friends. Question number three. If you could add any one member to the band, anybody, doesn't even have to be a musician, dead or alive, who would it be? Huh. Wow. My, my first I, I think John Belushi. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> my first thought was Lizzie from Miss Mister. I think that'd be awesome. Pass. <laughs> Pamela Anderson? Oh, that's interesting I choice. Don't I don't know. Mila she Kunis. All right, yeah, she can just stand there. Yeah, yeah. why not? Did you see that lit video? <laughs> what? <laughs> Did, didn't you see that lit video? Were the words that came out of my mouth? She's, she's like the lit video. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She is the stage. The band perform on top of her. <laughs> <laughs> Question number four: What would your role be in the zombie apocalypse? Um, uh, brain coordinator. Token first dead guy. Uh, I would discover Kevin dead. That would be my job. <laughs> and inform the others. Um, I don't know. I'd, I'd hope, my, I think my only chance would be to hope to be like the, uh, the Jesse Eisenberg zombie land character, the nerd who prevails. Very nice, very nice. All right, and last question. If your house were burning down, what was the, what's the one thing you'd grab? And I'd like to think not living things because I'd um, hope they could get out themselves. Yeah, I was going to say my dog, but. Yeah. Um, the refrigerator? <laughs> Pull it out. The whole thing. The whole Whatever thing. takes the most time to yeah. get out of the house. Exactly. <laughs> uh, maybe this pinata that we got on tour. This fan made us this pinata. Um, and asked uh, all of her friends and just asked the internet to send her love notes about Walk the Moon. And it was like the most wonderful fan gift, uh, like little love bomb that we've ever gotten and it made me cry. And so I would That's probably so grab sweet. that. That's great, good answer. What about you? <laughs> uh, I, I, would, I don't know. I would oh. grab snacks because I'll probably be homeless for a second. I would so grab, it's probably a good thing to have some uh, snacks. On a related note, I would grab s'more, s'more stuff because uh, if your house is yeah. burning, you might yeah. as well take advantage of it. Dude, just grab the fridge. You can live in the fridge and have all the snacks in the fridge. Very thoughtful answers. Thank you so much, guys. I'm looking forward to seeing you later. And I'm Sam from WBRU. This is Walk the Moon. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much. much.